for a second. So what I'm going to do is a dry brush method again. And I've got flat black paint. Not satin or semi-gloss, this is flat. Okay, so I take this brush, get it in there. Do the excess on the cloth. And then I'm just going to... Okay. Well, that battery died because I wasn't paying attention to the energy level on it. Okay, so anyways, while before I changed the battery, I finished the first locomotive exhaust. Now, I don't know if this shows up well on film, but from here, you can see, well, I can anyways, the exhaust is much flatter around there than it is the rest of the top of the locomotive, so it looks more like a kind of a grimy, smoky residue. And it might even look a little gray, but technically it's not, because if you angle around, you can see it's still black, it's just flat, and it's not reflecting light. So, now, I'll do the next one. Okay, and I just kind of swirl it around the exhaust and make sure it gets over onto the area close to the fan here too. This is much easier to do when I'm not filming it because I've got my other hand and I'm trying to watch the screen and also watch what I'm doing. I'm probably not even filming what I'm doing. But no matter. Because I think I think you guys get the idea anyways. get much paint on that one. I took too a little bit too much off on the rag. <coughs> yeah, I wasn't even filming what I was doing, but anyways. Okay, so now those will dry. And that comes off my checklist. You can see the ones I've done first are already drying. It's really not gray. I guess it almost kind of looks on the film like it's coming out gray. But it's not, they're black if you look right down on top of them. They're still black. They're just flat and the rest of it's satin for now. I haven't finished graming the roof up. But that's my next step. Alright, so this probably isn't showing up on film very good. But I've uh, finished griming the roofs up to my taste anyways. I 
Okay, and then there's one more step I'm going to do, which is to change the number boards. And I'll show you how I do that. And then they should be done. I'll just kind of give them one last once over and um, make sure I didn't miss any little spots that I need to touch up on paint or everything and then they should be good to go.